Hi, Mike Munsey here, the Director of Noel Jones here in Mitcham. And to begin with, we hope that you and your family are keeping well. We thought we'd do a quick little update about what's happening uh, here inside of the real estate market and both in sales and property management. It's a strange old time, of course, balancing uh, work from home and business. And uh, for those who've got young kids or younger kids at school, uh, the homeschooling piece has certainly been a challenge for a lot of us. Um, from our side of things, uh, nothing's changed. We're a cloud-based business. Uh, obviously remote working, but nothing's changed in terms of sales and property management. Um, we meet daily on both sides of the business. We've had some really strong results over the last couple of weeks, and we thought we'd share a couple of those things with you just to check in. Um, to begin with, we're very excited to welcome uh, to our team a couple of uh, really amazing people. Uh, to begin with, we've got Liz Zhang, who joins us in the senior property management role uh, in support of our wonderful department head, um, Ivy Mao. Liz has got a great background, lots of life experience. She's bilingual. Um, she's a terrific at her job and a great customer service. So you'll really find uh, some great service from Liz. Um, importantly as well, for those who haven't met David Patterson, he's in the assistant property manager's role. Now that's a really crucial role inside of the business because of the moving parts that uh, he needs to do, such as the entry and exit reports, helping with the leasing and setting up and coordinating the leasing, particularly at the moment with all the technology that comes inside of that and making sure we've organised contactless key handovers and all the things that happen uh, when you're getting new people moving in and out of a property. So that's been super important. With regards to leasing, look, there's some really cool things happening there. So we're obviously not able to do inspections at the moment, but we are still leasing property. And last week we leased six properties. So we've had this technology in place for quite a while. And what we're doing is if the property comes to lease now, we're making sure that we're utilising the photography, getting the virtual tours organised, getting those professionally edited, making sure we're utilising old floor plans so that people when they look at the property site unseen, that they're confident in what they're getting, and they're able to make great decisions, and that we act swiftly on those applications that come through, and we're able to use our technology to bring people together and remove the length of time properties are available for lease. And we're having some really great success with that. And in relation to our leasing, it's well below the Melbourne leasing average in this part of the world. So we're very excited about that. With regards to routine inspections, so obviously at the moment they're uh, not included in the guidelines. So uh, we've already moved to start doing our Zoom routine inspections and going back to the digital inspections that we had to do uh, last year. It is our view that these will continue for a while uh, and we expect that, that that's going to be the case with the restrictions. So we just move straight to that because those routine inspections are very important because they are a check-in with the tenant, making sure we're across any of the maintenance issues that are there. We're keeping tabs on your property and making sure things are going really well. And of course, those condition reports, once they're available, will become available in your vendor portal. So you better go in there and check out the photos and have a look at all that and make sure that information is completed. Alongside that, of course, there's making sure that the lease renewal is in place making sure the appropriate rent's in place and just making sure things are smooth sailing in relation to your property. That extends to maintenance. So general maintenance for some items are, it is difficult with the current regulations to get some things done. Um, when any maintenance issues come forward, the uh, tenants have to use the portal system to actually put their jobs forward, take photos, make sure they really articulate uh, what it is, showcase what it needs to be and we can forward that to you for your consideration and for course instructions. Urgent repairs are obviously fairly simple. They come to us and we come to you for your advice. And of course, we've got that 24 seven after hours pager for anything that happens outside of business hours. In relation to sales, for those of you keeping an eye on the sales market, it's been an incredible couple of weeks. Um, the stock level remains really tight and uh, there's not that much property coming on the market. Some agencies have formed a view to not launch properties during this time and we've made the exact opposite view. And for that reason, we've actually sold seven properties in the last week and all of those have been sight unseen, a mixture of online auctions and private sales and a couple of off-market transactions as well, but we're looking at a really strong market. So I think from your perspective as a property investor, you can take real confidence in where the property market is. It's not really showing any signs at this stage of abating. In fact, I suspect that once these regulations start to open up in force in the coming months as we go forward, we're likely to see a further spike in buyer activity and potentially some further capital growth from there. So if there's any way that we can help you, we're a full service business, whether it's uh, from talking about your game plan in terms of your property, whether it's strategy related, whether you're looking to acquire another property, or simply if it's to connect you up with another professional, whether it be in the finance or planning or even renovations that you might be thinking of doing subdivisions, we've got plenty of those contacts that we can connect you up with and help you out to make sure we're giving you the best service we possibly can. So at any time, call our office at 9872 3995. We really look forward to seeing you in person. Take care of yourself and we'll see you soon.